Continuing coverage tonight of a deadly officer involved shooting in Pensacola. Now investigators at the state level have come in to investigate what exactly happened. News 5's Cody Long is near the intersection where the shooting happened and Cody, a busy scene this afternoon, but it looks like it's clear tonight. That's right, the scene is now clear, but investigators were out here for several hours this evening. This investigation centering around this house over here at the intersection of Brainerd Street and C Street. This is where an officer shot a man who they suspected had weed in his car. A neighbor who did not want to be identified described what she heard. I ran over there in the middle of the street, and then I heard, they like, pow, 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 six times, told her. Just before the shots rang out after 4 o'clock this afternoon, two Pensacola police officers in a marked car tried to pull a man over after smelling marijuana. It wasn't a high-speed chase, but the vehicle refused to stop. Uh, at that point, they would begin throwing narcotics out the window, still refusing to stop. Police say the man drove his car to this house and circled the house before stopping and getting out. That is where he got into a fight with the officers. The uh, individual attempted and eventually did disarm one of the officers, and the other officer fired his weapon. And the Florida Department of Law Enforcement is now investigating. They have not yet released the name of that man who was shot. We'll continue to follow this story and keep you updated as we get new information. Live in Pensacola, Cody Long, WKRG News 5.